WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here for the 11 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network uh, update. We're looking at this on uh, Thursday, the 24th of February. Dow's down uh, 635. It was down all the way to uh, 232,272. So it's come back 200 points from the low, but it's still down 647 points. This is this is a tough market because even within sectors, it's just the geopolitical economic situation is now. Uh, it's spread out to the point where um, the uncertainty for the market has become a little bit more certain because now we know that uh, Ukraine, Ukraine has been invaded. But at the same time, you've got crude oil, you've got gold, you've got a whole bunch of things going on, interest rates. So the factors are there as a worry. That's why we could be looking at the Dow holding to the lower range. It doesn't have to smash to the downside today unless the VIX index, which is trading off its high of uh, 37.79 is down to 34.40, still very high, up 3.38. If the VIX index goes anywhere close to the uh, 36 area, 36.50, later on, you could have another wave to the downside. But wow, look at the red candle. If that starts to pull back sharply and you've already got gold coming off its high, look at that, all the way from 1976 down to 1929, still a big move. Um, but it's come back. If you're looking at crude oil holding very well, crude oil is still up in the high range, 97.51, but it did touch 154. So those are the factors that are going to give you clues because the S&P then would need to be at instead, oh, turned a green candle from the low of the day. It's still down 42 at 18, 41.82. But this is the most important opportunity just to have a relief bounce to give some kind of uh, to let pressure come off the indices. And look at this, green for the uh, QQQs, although it's down 85 cents, 328.47. It went all the way down this morning to 318. This is a big comeback, 10 points. So this is really important, just kind of some kind of relief. And most importantly, look at the TLT. Yeah, fails again. It tried to rally, it went to 139.23, it's now at 137.88. And that's just saying that yields are determined to stay in the higher range. All of these are worries. But in the meantime, Back what we're looking, but back, back at the ranch, what we really want to look at is we're making the daily charts in cell modes in the, in the key indices, the weekly charts in cell modes we've been talking about on my show tomorrow in my uh, Tiger Technicians Hour at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. We're going to talk a lot about the candles coming up for the end of February into Monday. So that's going to be really important. Have a wonderful day. Stay tuned for Larry Presidente. Great shows coming up. And I'll be back tomorrow.